It was a very somber ceremony as the North Carolina Department of Correction remembered their fallen hero. The names of each fallen hero who died in the line of duty was recognized with a rose. Each name is a story of sacrifice, a reminder of the dangers of the job, and two more names were added to this list. Sam Peloche and Alden Elliott, 14 year veterans who were killed in a brutal attack in Charlotte during a shootout last week. These two officers served as special operations investigators with the Department of Adult Correction and were assigned to the U.S. Marshals Task Force. Governor Cooper recognized Peloche and Elliott, along with the two other officers who were killed in this attack. Cooper said this loss is profound and these officers won't be forgotten just as the other fallen officers who have died in the line of duty. My prayers are with those families who've lost these officers and my prayers are with these families who see their officers go to work. My most sincere prayers go out to the families and friends we have lost this past week and over the years. Also today, the Department of Corrections will honor their Correction Officer of the Year. Those officers certainly have a very dangerous and unpredictable job as well. In Raleigh, Jimmy's Price, ABC 11 Eyewitness News. A memorial service will be held tomorrow in Hickory for William Alden Elliott. As you know, he was one of the four officers killed last week in that tragic shootout in Charlotte. The service begins at 6 p.m.